Belgium is feeling the impact of Europe's migrant crisis. Here in Zeebrugge, some people try to smuggle themselves onto ferries bound for Britain. Belgian police don't want to see a repeat of Calais. More than 450 migrants have reportedly been stopped in the area over the past month. Me go to England, England, my, uh, my uncle, my cousin, here help me. Okay, yes. Um, this here? Yeah, here, no. No. Belgium very good. People very, very good. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Help me for water, for food. Many migrants turning up here in Zeebrugge are taking shelter in and around the Stella Maris Church, with locals doing all they can to support them. But controversially, one local official has said that food should not be given out. On the Belgische coast is it verboden om meeuwen eten te geven. At the Belgian border, he says, it's forbidden to feed seagulls because there are too many of them. But these are people in a difficult situation. You have to give them food. It's irresponsible to leave them to starve. If we don't feed them, they will search for food themselves and commit burglaries. Seebrugge is part of the city of Bruges, where the mayor is also wading into the debate. He thinks many migrants are not genuine asylum seekers, but rather fortune seekers, exploited by traffickers. We have really the impression it's the first group to look what is possible in Belgium, and the message is Belgium is not France. But with tough conditions in Calais, the traditional port of choice for people wanting to get to the UK, it seems a Brugger is now becoming a magnet for migrants.